Welcome back to Proud to be Irish, my little shamrocks. Today we are at the Rock of Dunamays <clears throat> and we are going to do an expedition to see if we can capture any hauntings as the Rock of Dunamays is over 1200 years old, has had many different buildings built on top of it and has many battles, many deaths, many owners and many generations from the Nordic to the Vikings and it's going to be a hell of a long trek because it is massive we're going to first go to the church which you can see here and then we are going to make the long trek up to the rest of the rocket under maze which is behind us mm -hmm. um, so there's many videos to come of this, not just today, but in the future where we're going to take out a metal detector and see if we can find old relics. And during the day we'll be here as well. And we're going to see if we can find hidden tunnels, blah, 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 blah. So, let's get on with the video. Let's do it. Never. <laughs> Here, look at this how handy I have the light set up on my camera. That's actually pretty good. <laughs> Funny if you're like regular house key or something marked for Oh, I know. <laughs> Imagine it was open this time. You hardly have a house key like that. It's never open. Oh, he has one, I know. <laughs> oh, that's too short. You know that problem, don't you? <laughs> so here we are coming to the first gate this is actually called the first wall and it goes all the way around the perimeter and this was the first <clears throat> point of defense you can see the top of the castle just up there that's the second wall up there you can imagine the sheer size of this castle. Just even looking at that, like that tower extended up far. And if you look over there, like that castle would have been huge. Massive. And towering over a place, like you'd have aerial advantage. And I'd say that's I'd say that's probably where they dropped where it'd be oil or stones or something on top of them and let it then roll down the hill. Yeah. Looks like there was another door there. Because like, imagine all this would have been closed off, closed over just here. Would have been kind of like a hallway, if they've got windows there. And the reason for the windows being so small was you'd have archers sitting in there and they'd be shooting out arrows. It would be very hard for someone shooting arrows in to actually get at them. So that's the reason for the small windows. It's also a safety measure as well, just in case the wind's going to attack. 
people. It's also the same direction. So what we'll also be doing is when we explore a bit of this, me and Graham are gonna go our separate ways. And uh, we're gonna see, have kind of different videos and see if one of us encounters something that the other doesn't. There's going up there. Is the same one like that? Or the other one like that? the chills that's in here think about how many people would have been in here walking in and out I know the same one here yeah just walked up it. Imagine though, that was also awesome. Yeah. If there was a swarm up here, you could just run around and then actually like flank them from the eye. Get out to the window. I mean, can you get in from behind there, can you? Yeah, you can get in. It goes the whole way around. Right, so we're actually doing it? Yeah. I'm going to split up already? Yeah, let's do it. All right. Catch on, Catch on the flip side, kid. <laughs> Who's going to die first? <laughs> now, since we're splitting up, look at this now, just another bit. I wonder what this was used for. So now, since you don't hear the both of us talking, um. It'll be easier to hear if certain things happen. Ah, the rain ruins everything. I have to try to stop the camera from getting wet as well at the same time as trying to record. <clears throat> Already you can see he's gone. It's just us. stand on different edges you can see all the way down and that's a big drop on the side of it now that far up they can't even see the bottom big it's a road down there 
Oh, I felt like getting pushed there. Oh, keep away from the edges in case someone, something like that. Oh, fucking hell, decides to push me. <clears throat> but I legit, legit. Put the camera around the corner first! <laughs> oh, you scumbag! That was absolutely brilliant! I can see you coming back! Hang on! I'm going to turn off the light! Fucking wanker! Here he comes! Shit, he's got the attraction! Like, you like, shit, what was that? Because, <laughs> see oh. that stone up there at the very top? Yeah, yeah, yeah. When you said that, I was looking at that, I thought it was a face. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I was actually just walking up here and I was just saying that, like, fuck you, you know? Right. Uh, this one it's very quiet oh, yeah. it's kind of eerie feeling like I mean, <clears throat> I'm just thinking to myself, think of the technology they had back then. And then if you look up here, you'll see s sheets of what looks like slate to make the rounded part of the arch. I'm surprised there's no writing anywhere. Like, see, these type of bricks looks like it was filled in much much later in the years because they're a different kind of brick than what the rest of it is made up of walking around and chatting the thing about this is we were just chatting because we we're trying to get them to come out and have a little talk session out here is warm as soon as you walk in here the breeze gets louder and it gets chilly in here it's so much colder in here 
Is there anything with us right now? We want to know your story. There's a few of you. We can feel it. There's, we feel there's a few spread out around us. I feel like we're in a circle. Am I right? We are not afraid. Move that rock if you're here. This rock standing right in front of you. Use our energy or your own energy to manage. Yes. It's quiet now. Calm before the storm. We're coming in. Are we allowed to come in? Can we enter? Dead silence. It feels so much darker up here now than an hour ago. Doesn't it? Man, it's like jet black in here now. Like even 10 minutes ago, it wasn't that dark. Hold on. Did that rock move? I don't know. Wasn't that turned the other way? Like so. Or something similar. Oh shit, it might be. We'll have to go and check the footage, recheck the footage. I'll have to look back at that now. Has anything changed here? Okay. So, I'm going to draw a cross. on the ground I will then leave if the cross has been moved I know you're not a nice spirit or if you put the rock on top of the cross this stick I will leave beside the cross if it gets moved onto the cross we then know you're a nice spirit because it's lighter and we will put this rock on the other side if you put the rock on the cross you're an evil spirit I feel sick Right, I'm going to take some photos now. Oh, fuck. If there is something here, can you either move the rock on the left hand side of the cross or the stick on the right hand side of the cross? If you move the rock on the left hand side, you are going to indicate to us that you are a malevolent spirit. If you move the stick onto the cross, that would also symbolize that you are a good spirit. We're going to walk away so you don't feel under pressure like you're being watched. And we'll be back in a few minutes. Okay. 
so we take it there's no spirits here. Is that true? If we're wrong, prove us wrong. Show us that there's somebody here. If you do not move anything, we are then going to believe you do not exist. If you do not exist, then you cannot tell us your story. Which means if you do not exist, we will remain here for a long time and we will keep coming back. If you show us you are here, it's a sign you want us to leave and we probably won't come back. Would you prefer if I had made a satanic symbol instead of a cross? Don't be afraid to speak to us. If you don't want us in this room, throw a rock. Now. Throw something against the wall so we know to leave this room and give you some peace. Use my energy. Use Graham's energy. Show us that there's something here. We're not playing peekaboo. We know that the paranormal exists. We know there's angels and demons. We know there is ghosts, spirits, demonic possession. We know all this exists. We know you have the energy and strength to provide the necessary sightings. Hail Mary full of grace. <laughs> Hail Mary full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for our sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and deliver us, Lord, until evil. Amen. 
if you're allowing me to say, oh, oh <laughs> I felt like something just walked through me. If you allowed me to say these prayers, there must not be anything evil here. Oh. Yep, did you feel it too? Oh. Are you a good spirit or an evil spirit? Use my energy to draw a rock. We know you're here, we felt you pass through us. Eerily quiet. Once for yes and two for no. Or just don't flicker at all. Once for yes. I forgot to tell you. When I was saying the prayer. The stick in the stone, and it kept getting. You know the way if something's moving, there's you'd be a box trying to focus in on it. Yeah. The box kept going up around them, and then above it, and then below it, and then above it, and then below it. That's so strange. Can you turn off my light, please? We'd like to sit in the dark with you, so do you want to turn off the light? Use your energy to turn off that light. Oh, that was a flicker. Man. That was a flicker. Can you turn it off, please? Come on, I know you can do it. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Please. Can you turn it off, please. Can you turn off that light, please? We'd like to sit in the dark with you and talk to you. Come on, turn off the light, please. It's moving. Can you turn it off? Use your energy to press the button near the white light. Turn off the flashlight. Do you want to speak with us? Flicker the light. If you would like to speak with us. Okay. okay. Right. Is it just you that's here? Or is there many others? Is there one here? Is there many people here? Flicker the light if there is one with us at this moment, or flicker the light multiple times if there are other people with us. Okay. Thank you for communicating with us. Would you like us to leave that cross there for you? Or would you like us to get rid of it? We're about to leave, so now is your chance to tell us. Would you like that cross to remain here? Or would you like me to get rid of it? Fuck, I lost that bet. Fuck. Okay. Last chance, we're about to leave. Will I leave this cross here? Or will I dismantle it? Or will I make it bigger? I'm going to take... Oh my God. Um, I'm going to take a few pictures just before I leave. 
of the cross. If you are photogenic, what's wrong? No, no, I didn't. <laughs> if you're photogenic, stand somewhere around the cross. Thank you for communicating with us. Thank you. And we will be back again, as you never told us that you did not want us to come back. So, hopefully you will be able to rest in peace when you find your way.